Hey guys, what's up? One can I see Zoo here? And I was thinking of maybe doing a Pokemon Let's Play. But I thought doing Nuzlocke, so just playing out through would get pretty boring. So I thought, why don't I make my own Nuzlocke variant? So, welcome to the tutorial of the Wonka Little Challenge. Wonka Little comes from my, the Wonka in my name, and then the Conk Little. You combine those together, you get Con Wonka Little. So without further ado, let's get into the rules. Rule number one, a Pokemon must be nicknamed after another Pokemon of that region. So if you're playing a X and Y and you pick Froakie as your starter, you have to nickname Froakie after another Pokemon of Kalos. But you cannot nickname it after Legendaries or Event Pokemon. So for example, uh, Magma and uh, Electabuzz, or yeah, yeah, Electabuzz. They're event Pokemon actually for X and Y, so you cannot name it after them. However, you can name it, uh, you can nickname it Magmortar, or Magby, or Elicate and Electivire, because they get those, they get the Magmarize and the Electivizer, or whatever, Electrolyzer, that makes them evolve, but they didn't give them, they didn't give them the evolve forms. So, yeah, no event Pokemon or Legendaries. Two, another Pokemon. If a Pokemon dies or faints during a battle, you have to box. It can't be released. This is why it can't be released because it goes into rule. Number three, you can bring back a Pokemon by sacrificing another Pokemon or basically boxing it if it's 20 levels higher. So if I'm playing Fire Red and I lose my Charizard, that's at level 10. But then I also call it Capture and Train Up a Spear to level, technically be a Pharaoh. Up to level 30, you can put you can box it forever and bring back your Charizard. What Charizard can't be rolled in. Whatever. <laughs> you guys get what I mean. Number four, you may not use Pokemon Centers, but you can if you get a token, and that's only by beating a gym. So let's say I'm going up to the first gym and I've healed all my Pokemon with max potions. Then if I beat a uh, block in Pewter City and Fire Red, I get one token. And you go to the Pokemon Center and you can heal up. I got the idea from Shady Penguins, so shout out to you, Shady. I thought it'd be nice to have your rule or whatever in my Nelsock variant. Number five. This is. It's like uh, the same thing of every Nelsock. First time Pokemon you counter on every route, you have to ca capture. Doubles do not count. That's pretty much self explanatory. Long. Number six, this is only if you're playing on um, emulators. Grom must be randomized, if possible. Mainly just randomize the starters. If you don't know how to do that, look it up. I don't have decent quality to show you guys how. So, yeah. Rule number seven, again, just for Groms. If you randomize starter, like when you randomize a starter, if it gives you a grass, biting, or dragon type, you have to pick it. So if I'm playing Pokemon Diamond on the computer using a decimal and I randomize it and I get a Charmander or uh, what's it called? A Charmander or uh, Storyly I mean yeah Storyly or what's some or let's just say Flygon you have to pick the Flygon pretty like I thought that'd be cool my pants are adding up Rule number eight, if you get two of the mandatory types or all three, you can just choose whichever one you pick. So if you get, what like going on, Pokemon Black away if you randomize it, and you get, um, you get a Snivy, a Scrafty, then a Flaxer, you can pick it. It's like, it's up to you. Number nine, this can work with, you can combine it with other Nuzlocke variants. For example... Just add it to the wedlock and the one go to challenge. Combine it. I forgot this is a little complicated. But just read up on other on the other Nelsock rules and figure out how to combine it. If you have to edit a major rule, I'm totally okay with that. But yeah, I just thought that'd be cool. Number ten. You have to kill all legendaries or sh and shinies. If you count a shiny Pokemon, you have to kill it. Now, let's just say it's mandatory for you to catch the Pokemon. Let's say, like, in a Pokemon X and Y, you have to catch your yeah, Felter or Xerneas. That's completely alright, because you need to progress the story. 
And yeah, so those are the 10 goals of the Wonka Little Challenge. I am your host, Wonka Nama Zuzu, and have fun. Boom!